Getting started on your taxes. It's never too early to start gathering your tax records for next year's tax return. The earlier you start, the better and easier your tax preparation will be. Most people aren't sure what to collect and how to organize what they have. Let's look at some simple ways to get started. First and foremost, you need a place to store your receipts, notes, and other information. This doesn't need to be fancy. An old shoebox is actually one of the best places to keep your information, since it has plenty of room and a lid. For an electronic storage solution, register with Jackson Hewitt's My Tax Manager, a new online tax management tool, and one-stop personalized web destination for taxpayers. More complex is what to keep. For starters, be sure to save all income records, such as W-2s, 1099s, and receipt books or mileage logs. Always keep receipts for charitable contributions, and keep a list of the items you donated and their fair market value. If you itemize deductions, you may be able to deduct the fair value of the items you gave to the charity. And keep copies of your tuition and fees, books, and other education expenses that you or a family member may have. This documentation may help you qualify for an education tax credit or a tax deduction. Another important key to getting started is to locate your prior year tax return and include it with your other records. Make a list of questions and concerns you have for any life changes, such as getting married, having a baby, or buying a home, which may have occurred during the year. Most importantly, find a local qualified tax preparer and schedule a tax checkup to see if you can benefit from any year-end planning. He or she will be able to explain how any tax law changes may impact you and what associated materials you may need to bring when filing. Remember, extra preparation can mean a bigger tax refund, so be sure to store all of these items. For additional suggestions, visit Jackson Hewitt's website for a what to bring checklist or consult with the IRS website.